Hi guys, I'm here in the very south of Berlin in the street Am Studio 2A. There's a lot of companies here, lots of space, affordable space, it's subsidized. And uh, we're gonna visit Fizzard now and talk to Peer, one of the founders, and he's gonna give us a little office tour and tell us what Fizzard is all about. Let's have a look inside. Hi Peer, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hello. Thanks for taking the time. I'm coming in. So, tell me, what is Fizzard all about? Well, Fizzard uh, develops digital solutions for physical fashion stores. Okay. And we use methods from the e-commerce and transform them into the physical world. By doing this, we can combine the strength from both worlds. Perfect. We're going to yeah. have a look at the product a bit later. Maybe let's first here enter and have a say hi yeah. to your team. Mm -hmm. These are also founders? Or? Yeah. Uh, here we have uh, Jan, our front-end developer. Hi. Hey guys. <laughs> and Martin, our backend developer, okay. uh, both are founders yeah, cool. as well. And here we have our top uh, founders. This is Stefan. Hi, Stefan. Hello. He what, is, what is he doing? He is our CTO and head of sales. Cool. How and actually did you come about the product? And then you can explain also a bit how it works. Uh, did you have some affiliation with the retail industry before? Or? Yeah. yeah. Uh, our founders, mm -hmm. our team, uh, before we started Fizzard, we worked uh, at the e-commerce side, mm -hmm. uh, at uh, online retailers, mm -hmm. and uh, from there we got the idea that the main problem of fashion retailers mm -hmm. online as well as offline is the same, finding uh, the right size. Uh, the majority of customers go mm -hmm. two times into a changing room mm -hmm. and when they uh, didn't ah, okay. find after the second uh, try yeah. uh, in a fitting room, then they leave the store. Then they leave. Exact, exactly, without buying anything. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's why your screens mm -hmm. hang in the fitting room. Maybe let's have a look. Yeah, of course. Maybe you come to this side mm -hmm. and, I, and we can show a bit. So yeah. how does it work actually? So I get to the store and let's say you have a sweater here. Um, yeah, um, the articles uh, the people try on have uh, barcodes yeah. Yeah, on, the, on the label. Mm -hmm. And they only have to scan the barcode of the article mm -hmm. and then they just have to rate if it fits or if it is too small or too big. Uh -huh. And after the rating they see in this size this article is still available. Okay. Um, or they can uh, show other similar products okay. and can see in which sizes these articles are available. Yeah. So cross-selling then also, yeah? Cross-selling yeah. is also possible, mm -hmm. but these are similar products, okay. uh, which means our solution helps to increase the conversion rate mm -hmm. in store. And uh, when they select an article, they can uh, um, say, okay, please fetch me this article and the shop assistants get the information to fetch this article directly into the changing room. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. yeah. And this is a part for the, for the cross-selling okay. uh, because we know that people tried these articles on might uh, buy one of these yeah. articles yeah. too. Hmm? That's your expertise also from the e-commerce. Yeah, exactly. Then you do also help, help the offline stores with the um, analytics. Yeah. And let's maybe look at mm. that over here. Well, um, we track the whole customer journey in-store, mm -hmm. which means uh, we track uh, how many visitors had the stores, how many of the visitors uh, were in the changing room, yeah. which means uh, was, uh, were the articles attractive or not, and how many of the customers found articles that fit, mm. which means uh, this is uh, the main issue uh, of uh, bounce rates uh, in store. Okay. And how many of the customers that found an article that fits actually bought something. And yeah. uh, by tracking this, the, uh, the retailers can continuously improve their business yeah. systematically. You, as a founder, who inspires you? Do you have someone that you look up to and say, yeah, me personally, uh, my personal um, idol is Hasso Plattner. Okay, mm -hmm. cool. And why? Uh, I would say that Hasso Plattner is uh, the most successful founder that Germany had in the last 50, 60 years, mm -hmm. I would say. Yeah. Yeah, that's and that's why he's an idol for me. Yeah. Yeah. He really built a built a really big uh, company mm. yeah, and started with a team of uh, 
quite some persons yeah. like like we are. Yeah. Are you guys hiring also? <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, we are hiring uh, developers for okay. back end part as well as for front end part. Okay. And maybe in the next month too uh, we want to hire some sales people. Cool. Mm -hmm. So if you guys are looking, check it out. Nice yeah. team, very sympathetic. Yeah. Thanks a lot Thanks. for the tour. Thanks too. Yeah. And all the best for the venture. Huh? Thanks. Bye guys.